There he is. I can I can't know. The match starts soon. I can't know. I can't know. That's for sure. <laughs> okay, the meta for warrior is currently spellbreaker, so that's interesting as as it is. Let's go over belts very, 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 very quickly. Whew. Hold on to your points. Seems theirs. Soul Beast. Oh, Soul Beast. Then we got the Cheeky Weaver. Then we've got the Warrior. Core Warrior Summit. Then we have Strength Rune. Axe, Shield, Great Sword. Intelligence, Battle. Oh, Energy and Cleansing. Energy and Cleansing. Very defensive on the Great Sword. A little cheeky bit of intel could be good there. He's using it to get away. Let's go and have a look at Judd Pog. They're going to be 3v2ing over here on this side of the map. Looks like they want to just win this cheeky fight over here potentially and try and move back into the rest of the map. Maybe move into mid. It's been a while since I've casted. So you're going to have to give me a little tiny mini break here. Okay. It's all good. We've got the professional Grimjack. He's going to be always 1v1ing on the side No, Then we've got the 3v3 happening around the midpoint as well. Interesting map. Choice, fun times. Oh, bad job by Summer there. Needs to get out of there. Needs some support. Oh, no. He did. Ah. Oh. Teapot was trying to lie aside by giving some support out as well. He comes Div. He's going to bring out that famous board. Lich form and he's just going to absolutely decimate everyone by pressing one button. Amazing gameplay. In Guild Wars 2. <laughs> Connecra here as well, actually. Looks like we're going to see... Oh, nice port, actually. Couldn't, didn't get out of the trouble, unfortunately. Looks like... Uh, we might see him come back up. Cheeky Res. No, Zabdos. Wait, is this... I'm one... Zabdos? I don't know that's a Pokemon, but... I think he used to call himself Zabdos as well. I believe this is Mighty Teapot. Yeah, Mighty Teapot's NA account. Or he just switched over to NA region, of course, as well. Just trying to offer up some support to, to Summit. It's just basically trying to keep his team alive. The backbone of support. Nice knock back there. Just putting him off the top. We did see, unfortunately, a little bit of fear. Just in a little bit of a place. Needs to get back with his team if we can possibly do it. There goes the AoE cleave. Good job. Bring down that symbol. Damage is good. And they get the kill onto Tiny Leper. Oh, no. Lepra. Sorry. Tiny Lepra. Right, T-Pot is looking low, though. He's pulled out the Focus 5. He's got the blocks on. Someone's going to come and focus him. Here it comes. Oh, Apple is right in there. Solby's trying to be a little bit cheeky here. Sorry, Ranger trying to be a little bit cheeky. t in a lot of trouble. He needs to distract for as long as possible. Look at the skill from Mighty t Did such a good job of surviving. He's still, but he's still surviving, actually. He's still alive. Jesus Christ, this man. So, unfortunately... On his back, getting back up now as well. Judd Pog, they haven't got the support. Teapot's on the other side of the map. He got Chase there. He's a bit stuck. He needs to get back over to mid. He needed to leave. He didn't really have much of a choice. Couldn't get back up there. He just had to survive. That Ranger did a good job of pushing him all the way on to the other side of the map, actually. Really good job. By that Ranger with the push. Got Grimjack, who's going to try and get this decap over here. He's going to be the main 1v1er on this team. Because that just did get that res. Over towards the midpoint. Big support. Here comes Teapot. None of his team here, though. He does get the pull. Nice damage onto that guy. Just trying to finish him off. Fantastic job. They get the double kill on mid. Oh, good job. Look at Summit just trying to get that little cheeky cleave as he moves away. But he's in downstairs. He's going to rally them both. Oh, no. Summit rallied their team. No. All he needed to do was leave. Did someone port him into the mid to try and res him up? Oh, no. Oh, Summit just rallied the entire two members of the enemy the team. Good lord. Unfortunate there. I, I wasn't sure if he got pulled actually into the mid. Unlucky. Doesn't matter. It's all good. He's doing pretty well. He's been playing the game for like three days. Who cares? They're still doing well. They've got two cat. They could come back into this. There goes the root. There goes the buff that gives them that insta kill. And someone goes down as well. Good job. Tiny's just going to be trying to get that cat back. Grimjack trying to get back onto the node if he possibly can. Don't like the... Oh, yeah. Actually, really surprised they got that kill there, to be fair. It comes to the They've got to be so careful here as well. Just making sure they line the side. Get out of the way of all that damage coming out from the Lich form. Get some blinds off. Just line the side. They do a great job. Grimjack just ports out as well. The downstate of his teammate, unfortunately... 
He's going to be mighty teapot down and out. Not sure why we saw them push so hard over to this point, especially as people are starting to respawn. Majority of team members are here. We need to see this character move. The ranger needs to move over to mid like ASAP ages ago. Unfortunately, hasn't done it again. Inexperience is just all good. It's all well. It's okay. Summit needs to just leave. He needs to run away. He is doing that though. He's aware. He knows. He's been playing for three days. He's already better than 88.7% of the Guild Wars 2 PvP community. You might say that's not difficult, but I do. In three days of gameplay. It's okay. Just like that. that was a little bit of an error from uh, Teapot and Grinjet to push this 2v3. I think they were trying to give them a chance to outnumber out the rest of the map. But unfortunately, we didn't see the Ranger going to mid. Jack indeed is going to be taken out here. He should just, he's not going to have favorable. Okay, comes Teapot. Brave. Oh, he's going to get the raise. What? Oh my good oh, lord. Oh, but Teapot's not mid. Our That's where his team are going to go. You're going to see Summit maybe go to mid. Maybe they've communicated they're going to go to far. Who knows? They're going to go to mid. They're going to go to far. No, they're going to go to mid. <laughs> it's all good. We're going to try and take this character out. 1v, 2v1. To see if they can take it, Ariana, who is playing on the Firebrand, so he's going to be able to survive for quite a while. These guys haven't got a ton of experience in PvP, unfortunately. So it's going to take him a long time to kill him. So at the moment, the you want to see these guys on the other side of the map. No, in a 3v4, this shouldn't be happening. Oh, there's been an error in tactics. Who's in charge of this team? Unfortunately, they've opted to push for that far node and they've chosen to send two people versus a firebrand to mid they do not have the support there of course they might push him off the point it's potentially going to happen but i don't feel like this is going to be a win for this team unfortunately not looking great not looking great and at all and summit's just gonna have to try and get out if he possibly can he wasn't up got interrupted he needs to just bail here goes the knockback there's the ranger dude he is down unfortunately down and out they weren't able to take the fire brown down very quickly even great players might find it difficult to 2v1 a fire brown that quickly red fortunately the tactics have just artifact. not been with this red team some errors were made we've got some new players new guys coming out playing the game for the first time in an automated tournament and it's good to have summit here that's for sure doesn't really matter if they win or lose obviously probably won't be massively happy <laughs> if they lose <laughs> but at the same time still fun thing to do you would also is pretty cool you know you can just come in here and just have a bit of fun dailies aren't too crazy i mean it's pretty close, I guess, yeah. Did you see that? Red team got a capture point. Interesting builds as well. He just wants to play on Core Warrior, I think, until the end of the get until the end of the uh Until he gets to the expansion. So he doesn't need to actually like he's not gonna be playing any um elite specializations or anything at all. Wow, and did actually make a character called Divide My Cheeks. Who is this? Oh, they were going to get... Oh, sorry, he did get um, Grimjet, didn't they? Forgot about that. It's not over to this over. You never know. Here's the hope. Grimjack is the hope. Or is it Summit? Is Summit the hope? Oh, crap. There's the Lich form. That's not going to be fun. Look at that big AoE fear there coming out from the Lich as well. Really good job. Look, oh, Summit just gets wrecked by that Lich form. A lich form still a massive massive fiesta festival which is what i'm gonna say for that really wish you'd seen the firebrand playing with the plate people who are less experienced as well she's seen the support with the rest of the team but unfortunately that's not been the case we've seen two these two push far so much still not sure why that's been a thing they've been doing the entire game <laughs> should have relied on the two cap and just going and calling out targets the but they've gone for this power. fast strat and it's not paid them well and they've not changed it up much at all either very unfortunate got two pros in here who know to play the game what are they doing why are they pushing far all the time Seriously. It's literally not worked <laughs> they got one kill there you go oh i only get to do one game oh well
Unlucky. Unlucky. Yeah, I think they did alright, to be fair. They have to work pretty hard. <laughs> they got still some gold, right? I think that's gonna be it. That's all I wanted to do. I just wanted to cast Summit for a sec. See how it goes, you know? You have to pass along a message to me. Okay. That was just me having a quick break.